So hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You know it's your boy Dominic, which I told you I was gonna show you the view of where I'm staying. I told you that. Well guys, today's match day two of the CONCACAF Gold Cup. The quest for gold continues. USA face Panama. These two teams have faced each other about 16 times with USA winning 11, Panama winning five. If I'm wrong, comment down below, let me know. And we have another game, Nicaragua versus Martinique. I'm gonna combine these two predictions because I don't have the world of time, guys. I'm on vacation, enjoying myself in the sun, the sand, and the sea. But the USA face Panama today, and the USA have the edge, but the only thing is, USA chose to bring a very inexperienced squad. They have experience in the likes of um, Brad Guzan in the goal, Matt Beasley, Graham Zuzi in the defense. We have um, Chelsea um, Young, Starlet, Matt Miazga as well. In the midfield, we have Jayasi, Zades, and the prospective star boy of the tournament to look for is Dom Dwyer. Um, Panama, on the other hand, you know, has a pretty stellar squad. They have been doing pretty well in. Um, the World Cup qualifiers in the CONCACAF region and they are underdogs and you have to look out for Panama. They are one of the favorites to also advance from Group B along with the United States and these teams will be looking to start the tournament off right. This is Bruce Arena's first major tournament since he was reinstated as US men's soccer team coach and he will be looking to make a statement to, sit, to just show that they have made the right decision and he belongs going forward to the World Cup. If the USA makes the World Cup, that is. But guys, I don't have much analysis for, you know, like in the terms of too many stats and stuff for this USA versus Panama game. I only want to do a quick video and my prediction for this game is going to be a really good game. It's going to be a really good game. And my prediction for this game is a 2-1 victory for the USA. Panama will impress, however, and make it really difficult. But I would say a victory for USA to kickstart their 2017 CONCACAF Gold Cup campaign. The other game, the Nicaragua versus Martinique, expect that to be a really good game, similar to the Canada versus French Guyana game, which the turnout wasn't so good. The stands were basically empty compared to the Honduras versus Costa Rica game, but expect the Martinique versus Nicaragua game to impress as well. The CONCACAF Gold Cup has been very, very, very high octane so far. Two matches, guys, and two very impressive matches. I'm not sure if I'll be able to catch these games today. I will try, and I want to actually do reactions for all the games now. Like, I'm really excited about this Gold Cup. But friend, uh, Martinique versus Nicaragua, I'm going to put a twist to this one. Let's say Martinique victory, 1-0 versus Nicaragua. Or... A Martinique victory okay I'm gonna leave it open so guys leave your comments down below let me know your predictions for these two matches participate in the video please if you are seeing this comment down below don't be shy and guys of course we have hit 900 subscribers the road to 1000 is very much alive it's alive it's alive it's alive hopefully by the end of the Gold Cup I hit one thousand that would be awesome but guys one nil victory to martinique i'ma make it a little interesting and let me let me take my glasses off and the u.s versus panama game i would say a 2-1 victory for us let me know if you like the view of my island guys this is my island very hilly mountainous island st vincent and the grenadines guys vacation lovely right Lovely, as you can see the islands in the background over there, that's Young Island. And way yonder, you can see an island, Grenadine Island, called Beckway. Guys, it's lovely here, it's lovely. I'm gonna go enjoy this sun, might hit the beach, and who knows, maybe I'll do a little vlog video at the beach, but nothing is promised. So guys, let me know your comments down below. And until next time, I would like to say, love you from St. Vincent and the Grenadines.